everybody so for today's video i'm going to be doing a mini haul and a pack with me for new york city i'm going to new york city with my boyfriend eric and seeing his family we're driving there actually because i don't live that that far from new york i mean it's pretty far but it's not undrivable if you know what i mean so we're driving there but i'm going to be showing you guys just some things that i picked up to bring with me and also i'm going to be doing a pack with me so showing you everything that i'm packing in my little weekender bag because I'm not bringing a suitcase. I'm just bringing like a weekend bag. Going. First off, I thought I would just show you guys what I bought to bring with me for the trip. First off, we have a nice old Zara bag in my face. To start off with the only accessory that I got was this purse kind of bag thingy. I think it's so cute and perfect. I mainly got it just for going out at nighttime because my phone fits in it and everything that I could possibly need fits inside of this bag. It has like a bunch of pockets on the inside. So as you can see on the inside, it has like three pockets. So it has the middle zip where you could put like your money and your cards and stuff. And then it has a zip on this side and a zip on this side. So you can separate it, put your phone, sorry that's jingling, put your phone in one side and then you can also just put like makeup that you want to carry with you on the other side. So this is like perfect for me because I don't like to carry too much stuff. But I think this is definitely perfect for going out. I kind of wish it had gold details, but Silver's fine in the dress that I want to wear the one night that we're going out has silver on it anyway So then next up I got this really pretty dress I'm gonna bring this for one of my daytime outfits It's supposed to be super hot when we're in New York like it's calling for like 30 degrees or something So I want something just light and breezy this dress was $45 and it looks like this so it's just white and well cream and like a coral color striped dress it crosses over it has two buttons right here the back just has the straps like that it's just really really cute probably just gonna wear it with like sneakers and a purse nothing too special but and then next up i got this t-shirt which i just had to get like i had to get this because johnny depp young whew, i don't want to say he is my type now because he's really old he's still hot but you know just no um but young johnny depp oh damn like stop this so i got this t-shirt it's kind of like an oversized t-shirt but i thought i could wear it with either biker shorts or i could tuck it into like a denim skirt or just with shorts something casual and just wear it with sneakers and it'll be really really cute and he's just so hot like who doesn't want to walk around with his face on them i mean like hello then from maritzia i just got one thing which is just this bodycon ish black denim skirt this is so cute i already have this in pink just for going out at nighttime this is perfect you can wear it out to the bar you can also wear this just casually with like sneakers and stuff it's just like a really good item and i think it was it's pretty expensive this was around like 90 dollars canadian so pretty darn expensive but honestly i have never found a better denim skirt in my life so i had to get that one and then the last clothing item that i got was just this hoodie i wanted to get just a cute comfortable hoodie to bring with me because i know i get really cold <laughs> and i love putting on hoodies like at the end of the day if you know what i mean so like have the whole day and then by the end of it i'm like all right where's my hoodie and my sweatpants because that's the kind of person i am so i just got this hoodie from garage it was only like 40 dollars and it's just a gray oversized it's probably like a boyfriend hoodie it's called or something yeah the boyfriend hoodie and it just says california on it which is funny because i'm going to new york but i got a california sweater but I just feel like getting New York was too tacky, you know? And then last off, I just got one thing from Sephora, which was just a backup replacement, which is one of my favorite fake eyelashes. I wear these all the time. A lot of people ask me which ones they are. These ones are the Huda Beauty lashes in the style Samantha. So they look like that. They're pretty natural, but also just have like a little bit of flair in them. Now we're going to get into the pack with me portion, where I'm going to show you guys what I'm packing. Let's, let's roll clip <laughs> first up we have my two going out outfits because i believe we're going out friday and saturday night one night to a club <laughs> yes a club who knew i clubbed i don't i don't club but apparently we're going to a club this is the dress i'm thinking to wear to the club it's from the brand meshki so it's just this black like silky bodycon dress and then the straps are just like these little crystal straps it's super simple nothing too much so i think i'm gonna probably wear that with just like this bag that i got the problem is is that i want to only bring one pair of heels and these heels look so good with that outfit but they don't i don't think they really suit this <laughs> because this dress is just so like it's not even that much but for some reason it just looks super bougie and they just like don't go but these look so cute with this outfit so I'm having a problem here where I'm going to look really extra rolling up to Eric's cousin's apartment with two pairs of heels in my bag for one weekend. They're going to be like, this girl 
is a lot. I don't know about the shoes, but I'm 100% packing both of these outfits into my suitcase. So then this is my girly OOTD, I guess, for one of the days. So I'm gonna bring this dress. My Tory Burch purse, I'm gonna wear with white sneakers, so that's a little bit more casual and more my style. Um, I'm not, my sneakers are downstairs, but I mean, this to show a style, there's some sneakers, but I don't like the stripe with these ones. And then for my next outfit, I think I'm gonna wear the, okay, he looks really weird when he's all not straight. There we go, now you look hot again. I think I'm gonna wear the Johnny Depp t-shirt with this skirt that I got actually in New York in January from Topshop. So I'm hoping this will look cute together. I'm probably gonna have to try this one on. So this one's kind of a maybe in case it looks terrible. Like, you know, sometimes you lay out clothes and it's like, wow, that is so fashionable. And then you try it on, you're like, no, that looks terrible. But probably gonna wear this with some sneakers. I think that'll look really cute for another day outfit. Remember what I said about trying stuff on? Yeah, this I don't, I don't really, you know, it's just not that cute. In my head, I was like, yes, but the mirror, the mirror is telling me, <laughs> hell no, girl. 12,000 years later, I finally sorted out my second day outfit for either Friday or Saturday. So I'm gonna be wearing this full moon t-shirt from Zara. This skirt is from Aritzia. It's like a denim pink skirt. My Tory Burch purse again, and then I'm going to be wearing like sneakers with it. And that's my second day outfit. Thank God I finally figured that out because that was stressing me out a lot. Last but not least, these are what I like to call my travel slash comfort outfits. Kai, why are you crying, baby? So again, the Johnny Tup t-shirt has made a preview, but I'm gonna be wearing it just with biker shorts because this shirt ain't looking cute with anything else, but I wanna wear you, so I'm probably gonna wear it on the drive there or the drive home, one of the two. Probably both. Then last but not least, I have the hoodie that I got from Garage, the California hoodie, and then just a pair of plain black leggings as my other comfort outfit. So I'm gonna pack these as well, just to have like comfy options. I don't like to just have like cute outfits. I like to also have outfits that are just like lazy and comfortable because I am lazy and comfortable. Look at my hair. Trying to pack is making me look real ratchet. I managed to pack, figure out all my outfits, which is good, thank you. God, because I was stressed for a little bit there, but I figured everything out. My suitcase is packed. I'm so happy. Hopefully you guys enjoyed just kind of planning outfits with me for this video, kind of giving a sneak peek of what I'm gonna be wearing in New York. Definitely make sure you're subscribed with your notification bell on so that you won't miss my New York vlog when that goes live. And also make sure that you're following me on my social medias. I have Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter. Twitter? <laughs> Twitter. Everything will be down below. You can follow me on there and stay up to date with me while I'm in New York with Eric. It's gonna be so fun. And I'm just so excited. It's gonna be amazing. And I will see you all in my next video. I love you all so much. Say bye from Kaya. She's asleep. There she is. You sing bye? <laughs> Bye guys!